international competition. Yes. Uh, yeah, we have. Uh, actually, we're working. Um, we're right now we're tra targeting uh, Texas and oh, LA yeah. and then uh, the lowest in Europe. Uh, we're kasi tapos na yung pelikula for the festival. Uh, yung director namin si Alvin Yapan is actually parang doing na his international version. So, um, it will be, the international version will be a different, you know, kasi parang, because this is intended for the Philippines, mas mainstream yeah. kasi. So, in, ang intention ng cut ng pelikula mo, panood nyo later, is the parang Philippines version, the MMF version. For the international, si Derek Alvin, si Sir Ikili, kami ng mga producers, decided na it's gonna be different. And parang medyo, parang malaki yata, malaki ang mga bago in a way. So, hopefully, mapanood nyo yung international version, bago din na may ilang mga sadakas. So, may mga director's cut? Yes, parang gano'n. Parang we're gonna do the, parang the Philippines cut, and then the international cut. Jess? Last time you won Best Supporting Actress for Shargon yes. was that two years ago? Yes. How do you feel that you have another chance of bagging an acting award for because they said Abo. the three of you are the runners for best yeah. uh, So how do, you, how do you feel that you have another chance of doing it again? Of course it's always exciting to think of that possibility and that opportunity that award um, But I think more than that this time, ano na, it's, it's the feeling of being ranked amongst the names that I am nominated, you know, in that group of actresses. So, parang nas, nandun na ako sa feeling na, wow, am I really, ganun na ba? Karanking ko na sila. Parang, mas, ano na, ano, that's where I'm, my head is at, and that's where I'm more grateful for, because um, I already know what it is. I, I know the feeling of happiness from winning, you know, winning an award, but more so when you reach a certain level of um, stature sa industry na parang nagagawa mo na rin yung mga ginagawa ng mga taong inilino mo at nakakatrabaho mo na rin sila. Iba yung feeling na na parang wow, nakatrabaho ko sa kalsado ng Mary Soriano. And, and every time you work with new set of actors, it's, it's a fresh feeling of parang Talaga, ka, ka work, ito yung mga ka-work ko ngayon, nakaka, ano ba rin siya, nakaka starstruck or nakaka overwhelmed at times because to some extent, parang baguhan pa rin ako, uh, hindi naman ako mainstream na pangalan, so to get these opportunities, I mean, you know, uh, compared to my contemporaries na are more regularly seen on TV, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit more independent than in the indie world of things. May pitik-pitik sa TV there, the but um, it's not. I'm not. Uh, I'm not loud with my presence or my image or my branding. I'm, I'm very low key, simple, organic, and natural with how I do my life or my work. So, parang ano siya? Ano ba? Ano ko? Um, <laughs> I'm just. I'm just happy because nakaka work ko na yung mga dating na papanood ko um, or na na papas ko mga interview and they were the ones inspiring me in my first couple of years in this industry. Sino yung gusto mong makatrabaho next? Yung gusto mong gusto mo? I don't know. Uh, uh, kasi naka-work ko na si Iza and she was my target talaga. And then I worked with Ate Meryl last year in Cinema One. So this year to share frames with her and scenes with her para all in one with Iza also. Parang, that's why when Shani called me na oh, sila yung co-actors, parang ha? Huh? Ah, <laughs> uh, wait lang, kasi, <coughs> but it's still unbelievable at times. <laughs> so, yung next, si yung next na gusto? I don't know. Wala pa. Wala pa. Uh, Baby Maria. Baby Maria. Follow up. <laughs> Bakit tama mo ka? Then, <laughs> tatanong ko kung gusto mo makawork ang atin. Ah, yeah. Oh. Of course. <laughs> but busy. Busy uh, with the baby. <laughs> Just. Yes, of course. Follow up. Kasi, follow up. Okay. Al it's a wrong factor sa pagganyang malalaki ang cast. Medyo may mga ego, medyo simplicity. Kung saan na may check mo ego ng tatlong dalawa mo. Girls? Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Boys? No, the girls. Both of the girls. Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Kaming girls? Kaming So how is it? Nag-check ba? No, we're all good. We're all, we're very, we got along. 
we did all our scenes well, you know, everyone understood their face and what we were to do or kung paano kami walang cold treatment you know, everyone, parang lahat gusto lang talaga ang ma-promote parang maayos, magampanan yung role yung kwento ng maayos so, I think yun yung maganda uh, sa mga that's why I'm so happy sila yung mga naging inspirations ko as actresses kasi nung naka-work ko sila at yun na we share the same working ethics, ideals, and approach. Diba? Oo. Hindi kayo parang, ay, hindi rin siya mag-work. Parang, yeah, you guys run the same thing. Oo. Even with the boys as well, parang, pare-pareho kami ng mindset, and not just that, natututo kami sa isa't isa, paano kami mag-trabaho. Kaya, pag-i-approach din yun. Thank you. I'll go to you to end into the room. I watch your film. What is this period? What did you do different from Sabado? The difference? I'm a role coach. I don't know. What is this period? You know what I mean? But I need to ask the difference as a role character. We're kind of similar in a way. I have something to show you. Being typecasted. But maybe similar, but the role in Kulion is so unique in itself because it's really a role that I've never taken on before because, again, we all have leprosy and it's a historical drama, so we really, the mindset has to be totally different than any role you've taken on, I think, any other movie. So, that was. Oh, I mean, my you know my my role in Sabado is the show Bastos and. Very interesting, very interesting. Yeah, very interesting. But I mean, for Kulion, it's a different movie altogether. It's a historical drama, so in terms of the you know internalization and character for Kulion, it was a totally different preparation than I did for Sabado. But both both experiences were something that I definitely need going forward. Okay, thank you. That's that's the last question we can we can accommodate. Jude Salam, I play Mike. Yeah, and Mike Lamisa. Mike, I watch your film when you play the soldier. So a soldier, two triggers. Hindi yon. Okay, maganda mo siya ano? So anong challenge yung nagbigay sa iyo dito sa Kuya? Yung, yung challenge po dito na nabigay niya sa akin, um, ano kasi siya, buo talaga, physical, emotional, buong pagkatao po talaga, tapos yung may sakit pa yung leprosy. So ibang klase yung character po talaga yung, yung binigay sa akin dito. At ito po yung talagang role na hindi ko pa talaga natatakil. At never kong na-imagine na matatakil ko. So ngayon na nabigay siya sa akin, wala, buong puso lang talaga, buong kalaluwa yung puso. So I'm just so excited na mapanood ko po yun kasi Kita lagi last minute, last minute, terbaru mu, ibah. Kita nak cerita yang lain, ada. Yang lain, yang lain. Kita lagi. Kita lagi. Kita lagi. Kita lagi. Kita lagi. Kita lagi. Kita lagi